After taking two years to pass one of the toughest engineering licensing exams, I finally passed and got my structural engineering license in California. FYI, if you're new here, structural engineers are the engineers that design buildings and bridges so they don't fall down during earthquakes and windstorms. But now it's time to get my life together. Yeah. With the pattern of work, study, sleep, work, study, sleep on and off for the past two years, it's been pretty tough mentally and physically, and both my mental state and physical state have gone into the dumpster fire. So now I've been getting my life back together by focusing on health, hobbies, and relationships. So for my health during the past two years, I've been pretty disappointed in myself. I gained a lot of weight. I'm the heaviest I've ever been in my entire life. So it's been pretty embarrassing. I even had to buy large clothes. I was a medium before and I just couldn't take it anymore. I needed to get large clothes and that's just a sign of defeat. That is essentially signing a contract saying that you're large, that you're fat, that you're a chunky monkey, that you're a chonker. And I had to do that and that was probably a low point. And I've gotten sick recently as well. So that was a fresh reminder to show me how important health is. You can have all the money in the world. You can be living in a mansion. You can have a yacht. But as soon as you're sick, as soon as you're unwell, none of that matters. You're just thinking about how sick and unhealthy you are. So I've been taking my health a lot more seriously. I've started eating better, not the best. I'm taking baby steps. I eat a lot less burgers. I eat a lot more chicken and rice, and I've been taking vitamins and supplements to supplement all of the vegetables that I'm not eating. I've been exercising a lot more too. I've been going on a lot of walks and going to the gym consistently as well. And I still get coffee or Starbies every day, but I get it black at least. For my hobbies, it's been tough putting all of those on hold. The hobbies that I've had in the past, such as salsa bachata dancing, playing video games, making YouTube videos, they've all took a hit or I just stopped them altogether. And those were important to me because they'd be a form of stress relief and they'd keep me healthy as well. When I was really into those hobbies and learning new skills, it was my way of just shutting the entire world out no matter what problems or stressors that I had. It was just me and uh, the thing I was doing, the thing I was learning, it was peaceful in a way, just having your focus on just that one thing. It was kind of like a form of meditation. And it made me more well-rounded as well. I could talk to people about those things. It's really tough to talk about structural engineering for all the normies that don't know what structural engineering is. Yeah, screw the food, look at the dresses. <laughs> Nerd, dude. So it's been great getting back into my hobbies and forming some new ones as well. I've gotten back into playing video games with my friends again. I've been learning how to be a better photographer, videographer. It's been good to see that I can enjoy YouTube again and be more creative with it. And it's something that I enjoy a lot more now. And I've also been trying to learn golf. I've been getting some lessons from my dad and I learned that golf is pretty hard. Very hard. You're doing pretty bad. Nope. That was pretty bad. That's good. And I've always enjoyed learning new things such as listening to podcasts or taking new classes to learn some new skills. And that's why I'd like to thank today's sponsor, Brilliant. Brilliant is an amazing tool to learn STEM interactively. It helps you gain a deeper understanding of concepts in math, science, and computer science by taking you through the subjects piece by piece in a visually stimulating, hands-on way. One of the main reasons I got into structural engineering was its practicality, how we could use engineering principles to make a real impact in the real world. That's why Brilliant's scientific thinking course is one of my favorites. You'll go deeper than just the mathematics and number crunching. You'll gain physical real world insight into engineering principles and physics, such as gear, center of mass, light, and even how bridges work. It also provides simple explanations one step at a time. To get started for free, visit brilliant.org slash mattpicardle or click on the link in the description below. And the first 200 of you will get 20% off Brilliant's annual premium subscription. And for relationships, look, no one's gonna care how much you worked. 
They're just gonna care about how you treated them and how you made them feel. And my relationships and relationship skills definitely took a hit. Working, studying, working, studying, working, studying, constantly saying no to friends events, family events. Not only did it stagnate some of my relationships, but my social skills went into the dumpster fire as well. But Matt, aren't you always talking on YouTube? Uh, yeah, sure, I guess you could categorize that as speaking or speaking speaking to inanimate objects. So, uh, hey, how's your day going? Yeah. YouTubers, am I right? So, uh, no, that doesn't count. So I have been going out and meeting friends and family again, making plans to travel, and man, do I still feel awkward meeting new people. I don't know if I should fill in those awkward silences or just get used to them. But it's been good getting my social skills up again. And you know, the true friends are the ones that understand what you're going through, what both of you guys are going through. And once you meet up again, it's, it's like nothing's ever happened. And I've been visiting my family more. Uh, they've been especially helpful during my studies. They're about an hour drive to, to LA, so it's not that bad. But not only get to go see my parents, my brother and sister, but I get some free laundry in as well, as well as some free golf lessons from my dad. Thanks again for watching, and if you enjoyed this, make sure to hit that subscribe button as it really helps support the channel. I'll see you next time.